Hey, how you doing? Christopher Mosley here, and I'm back with another unboxing today. One of the most important things you can do before upgrading your camera and all your lenses and things of that nature is upgrade your lighting and your audio equipment. And one of the most important things to me are LED panels. They're very small, they're very portable, and I think I found the perfect one for me and my setup. I'm like a running gun, music video, wedding, um, try to pack light kind of videographer. So what I got today is the Aperture F7. Now this is a very powerful light. It's very innovative. It's not just your normal everyday, get it from Best Buy, order it from Amazon, $30, $20 light. There's a reason this light is priced the way it is and there's a market for this light. But without any further ado, let's get into the unboxing. I came prepared today. I got real scissors. And if you're new to my channel, I don't do a lot of specs and uh, the charts and all the graphs and the technical information. These are real world reviews, advice, and real scenarios and uh, tests that I do out in the real world. So if you're expecting charts and paperwork and graphs and reading from the manual, you might want to find you another channel. But if you like it the way I present it, go ahead and subscribe. Here we go. Let's get that plastic off. Here's the box. Very nice box. I actually ordered two of these because I wanted to pair them and uh, be able to have a backlight and a key light because these are powerful enough to use it as key lights. Now let's read some of the features of this. You have um, a CRI of 95, which means it has very accurate color rendition. You have a brightness adjustment knob, uh, battery, battery power display, and um, you also have a wide range of your um, selecting your temperature because it's by color. You go from 3200 to 9500, so it gets very warm and very cool at the same time. It's very versatile. Um, there's multiple ways to power these, and it comes with the carrying case, as you can see, as we get it opened on up. Let's move the box and I'll go ahead and start removing this and show you what's inside. Uh, just to start out, the packaging, man, this is like impeccable. To get a light and, and have it to come in something that you can actually use is just very much appreciated. I really appreciate the aperture. Um, if we take this out, let's go ahead and take this out first. You got the actual light, 256 bulbs. Uh, it feels a little plasticky, I'll go ahead and say that, but if you're like me, I really cher not cherish, but I take care of my gear. I, I don't think I'll be dropping it or anything like that, but I mean, it is plastic, so if it takes a bad fall, it, it just might break. That's just a heads up. It feels a little plastic, but it has weight to it. It feels premium, but it is plastic. Um, let's put that to the side. This is a USB type C cord. You can actually plug this light into a portable charger and power the light with the portable charger. So that's what makes this light very versatile. A ball head, and this is actually a very good ball head they give you in this packaging. So you could really use this to put it on a light stand or attach it to your camera, whichever one you wanna do. It also comes with diffusers. There's a clear one. And then there's a white one that's a little more diffused in there for people that would like soft lighting. They give you a card with some marketing information and social media. And then, of course, a manual in different languages and a warranty card. Hey, guys, if you haven't already, go ahead and follow me on Instagram at ccmosley, R-E-A-I-G. You can check out some of my work. I'm sure I'll be using these lights on all my future products. So just follow me on there and you'll be able to see all my work and all my content and uh, actually see how these lights work moving forward from here. I'm actually on the Aperture website. I don't try to memorize these stats. I'm gonna read them off to you. Some of the main features that make this um, product very competitive. It has stepless brightness control. So when you turn the knob to make it brighter, you don't see that, that changing in a, a, a forceful way, a way that you can see it on the actual recording or the footage. It's stepless. It goes from 1% all the way to 
You got some LEDs that go from 10 all the way up to 90 and then they jump up to 100 or jump all the way down from 10 to you have way more accuracy with this one. It has a D-tap if you want to use V-mount batteries and power your whole system and then you use F-mount batteries, the Sony little F-series batteries. I recommend the 970s. Now one of the main reasons I purchased this light is that when you get to 5600 Kelvin on the color temperature on it, it gets very, very powerful when all of the LEDs are in use. It's kind of hard for me to explain it in technical terms, but between 5600 and 5500 Kelvin, that's the brightest point of using this light. From there, the higher you go, the colder it gets, or the lower you get, the warmer it gets. So for it to get be by color and still get very, very bright at 5600, that was one of the main selling points for me. Now this light is gonna be for somebody that's running gun, that needs something small, uh, portable, versatile, um, it's very lightweight so it can fit in your bag and you won't notice it really. Um, but it's very powerful. Like I said, it can be used in multiple different scenarios. It's around $98. I think I paid $107 when you add in tax and shipping and everything. But I think it's very much worth that price for what you get. Especially with the carrying case, the ball head. It's probably worth about $9 or $10 alone. So... I think it's worth it and then you got a reputable brand that's uh putting a lot into marketing and uh different features i mean it's it's a well-made product i would recommend this for all of my videographer friends or photographers that need any type of lighting um any scenario where you would need lighting filmmaking this would be the perfect for you like try it out go ahead and purchase one if you're new to the channel go ahead and subscribe um Leave a comment and let me know if you like this video, what I could do better on my reviews because I'm still learning and growing. I'd like to add more to the channel. So if you have any suggestion for my reviews, let me know. In the meantime, check out all my content from here forward. I'll be using these lights so y'all can see how they worked out.